Yo, what's going on everybody? It's your boy Boone coming at you all with a brand new video. A very exciting video because today the old, the old Boone is going to be making a comeback. It's been quite up. some time since I've done one of these top 5 or top 10 list videos. I don't know why but I felt like today was the day to bring this video idea back from the dead. So um, if you guys have any other list videos you'd like to see from me, any other top 5 or top 10s, comment them down below. Today though, we're going to be talking about my grails, the things I dream about at night besides Selena Gomez. That's right, we're gonna be looking at all the supreme items a homie craves. <laughs> this thing is so fire. Like, these are the things I need in my life. Um, not really, all I need in my life is you guys. You guys are all my best friends, but um, let's talk about these items. I don't wanna do a big ass intro today, so I hope you guys enjoy the video. And oh my God, I almost forgot to say, if you guys own any of the items in this video, please slide into my DMs like I'm a cute IG top. Like, please, you guys, I really wanna cop a lot of this stuff. I'm a size 30, 32 in pants and like a size large, medium in jacket, so pull up on the kid, but let's begin this video. I hope you guys enjoy. Before we begin though, my cat is begging yeah. to get into my room. She wants to say what's good to you guys, so I gotta go grab Shotty real quick. So here is my cat. Um, shouts out to her. This is my number 10 grail of 2020, and I already secured her. Um, I actually wanted a cat so badly though, so like that was my number 11 on the list. Had to go secure a cat, but for number 10, um, we have a pretty obscure item I'm sure none of you expected to see on this list. The John Paul Gaultier Pinstripe Cargo Pant. <laughs> Bro, these are absolutely gorgeous. Like, you do not see Supreme make some pretty quality, like, high fashion items. I absolutely love what Supreme did with this design. They basically just took some suit pants, added some cargo pockets, and for whatever reason, it goes crazy in my opinion. It came in front with me. This shit's kind of fire. And of course, I didn't cop. I don't know why. I really have no idea why I didn't buy these. I mean, I do. They're like $358. No way I can afford that. However, um, I do think they are amazing. You could wear these and a lot of outfits as well that aren't just like suits or anything like that. Um, these will go really nicely with just any collared shirt. Like I love these pants so much. Please don't cat, please don't, please don't. Come on. Severely underrated, by the way. Like, no one talked about these when they released. They now are selling for like over $500, so definitely a sick pair of pants. But the fact these cost so much money is the reason they're at my number 10 slot. But let's continue on to the number 9 slot, and this time, we have a t-shirt, the Muhammad Ali vs. Superman T from 2000. This is a really sick one again. I love the graphic on this. My man Muhammad Ali is absolutely serving out the fade to Superman. First off, you guys gotta let me know who would win this fight? Like, if we really think about it, if I had to choose a side, though, I'd probably go for Superman because, like, homie's invincible. He's got the cheat codes, but um, I think this graphic is just gorgeous, and I always love my old-time Supreme shirts. I do enjoy this shirt. doesn't just say, like, Supreme all over it. This is what a good design looks like. Like, it doesn't have to say Supreme to be fire. Add on the fact that this shirt's, like, 20 years old at this point, and you got a grail. Um, it's hard to find these for, like, under three or 400 bucks, so I'm still searching, but if you got one, you already know what to do. Pull up on the kid. For the number eight slot, we have our first and only shoe for this list. Um, we got the Supreme Comme des Garcons Herald Hunter High Top Skate High Vans. <gasps> God, that was a long title, but it deserves it because this is just like an iconic Supreme van in my opinion. I don't think they'll ever top this one. Like, I don't know which vans is probably my favorite of all time, but this one is near the top. I absolutely love this shoe. For those that don't know, Harold Hunter's a skateboarder. Like, obviously he's skating in this photo. He's also in the kids movie. Um, he's just a dude that's in a lot of different Supreme items. I already have like a couple pieces that feature Harold Hunter on them. I just love this shoe so much. I think it's so sick. Like not only do you have the photo of Harold Hunter, but like the pinstripes, oh my gosh, so sick. Nice. I just am in love with this sneaker and I think anyone that's collecting Supreme Vans has to have this in their collection. And like I've probably said by now a billion times on my channel, I'm trying to collect the Supreme Vans. So I definitely got to add this one to the collection. I want any of the colorways. I just love this shoe so much. Size 9 or 9.5 pull up on me, but let's continue with our list. Moving on, we have this sweater that I don't even know why I like this one. Like, you guys are definitely gonna judge me when you see this. I, I don't know, man. I got no explanation. We have the Supreme Hate Crew Neck. Um, you guys know me. Like, I just love my edgy sayings, and I love this design so much. I really can't explain it. Like, there's no reasoning behind why I'm so in love or captivated by this sweater, but I just need it in my life. I hate everything. 
except for you guys and my cat and like Supreme and a lot of stuff. But I don't know, bro. This is angsty as hell and a homie needs it. I don't honestly take any colorway, but the black or white are definitely like the premieres. Actually, I don't even know if I touch the blue one. I just love like that pink font. I just think it's gorgeous. And I would add a couple other items to this spot because I love a lot of these sweaters that Supreme does. The pink panther sweater is another one that I'm just like, please, anybody hook me up with. I love the pink panther. Um, and also, one of my favorites is the child of hell sweater, which I've been looking for for years at this point. I'm a child of hell, bro. Like, please hook a homie up. This whole video is me begging for you guys to sell me stuff. It'd be like that. Next up is another kind of weird one. This is a more recent item. Probably the most recent item on this entire list. Um, we got the Supreme Plaid Front Zip Sweater. And I already know y'all laughing at me like, oh, Grandpa Boone. And yeah, you're right. All right, I get it. This looks like a grandpa sweater, but that's my vibe. I love this thing. Um, I just think this is such a sick piece. Like, it really reminds me of the Comme des Garcons collaboration from 2015, I want to say. I can't remember the exact year, but you guys know which one I'm talking about, the plaid. Um, I love this piece so much. Both colorways they dropped were gorgeous. It was 200 retail, and now these are going for like 300, 350, so definitely a steep price tag. Is it worth it at that price? I don't know, but like, I still want to buy this one really badly. I prefer the black colorway. Um, I just love this thing, dude. I think it's so sick, and it looks really comfortable. I definitely think I'm going to end 2020 with this in my collection because I just need to have it. I'm super salty I didn't buy this when it released. I'm pretty sure it flew under the radar, but super sick item. And since we're on the grandpa wave, I also have to throw in the floral cardigan from last season. I still regret not buying that so much. I knew it was going to resell too. I told people like, don't sleep on the cardigan. Then I slept on the cardigan. And then of course, when I don't buy it, bans, it resells. Bans, bans. So There's yeah, that's Throw where my it. life's at. It's sad, but let's continue on. Somebody sell me this sweater, please. So I can shut up and stop crying. Hold on one sec, fam. That was kind of an emotional one. Let me just get some espresso. Let's continue on with our list. Next up, we have the Rose Sherpa. Damn, son, you <laughs> this is a classic. I'm sure a lot of you guys have seen this one before. I feel like this is one of the more popular, like recent Supreme jackets. Um, this thing pops. Like not only is it reversible, but you got the grandma couch all over print. I don't know why, but my entire drip looks like I came out of a retirement home. So I need this one. I'll be looking like your grandma's couch real quick. Um, I love the floral print they chose for this. It's so nice. The colors are just gorgeous. Like <laughs> somebody sell this to me, bro. I've been looking for one of these for quite some time. Pretty much every reversible fleece Supreme does, I just want, like I want to start a collection of them. But I also just want to collect everything Supreme ever. So I need to chill, but I won't. I'm not going to chill. I'm definitely going to end 2020 with this item as well. I need this in the collection. I know one of you has it. So I've kind of lost count of where we even were with this list at this point, but I think this is the number four slot so moving on we have the supreme comme des garçons carpenter pants and this is another emotional one you guys i don't even know what i was doing on this release i for whatever reason did not buy a pair of these pants and i still hate myself for it because i think these are so fire i'm sure some of you think these are disgusting but like this is my list this is my taste so just get away from me don't hate on the kid but that blue pair oh my god i will say the white and the black are like a little sus they're a little too loud but that blue pair is so appropriate um, for those that don't know it says justice for all all over it ear snot iraq did this piece ear snot's a very famous graffiti artist that is so sick he's got a really dope hand style and i'm just like a huge fan of graffiti if you don't know back when i was in high school and stuff i was just super obsessed with graffiti and graffiti artists so i need to get these i'm just a big fan of supreme graffiti collaborations this is no exception and the fact it's comme des garçons bro like <laughs> please why don't i own these already Y'all got me so messed up. I cannot find a pair of them like size 30. So, I mean, I've said it 50 times, but pull up on the kid. So that's going to bring us to our top three items I need to buy in 2020. And all three of these are just, just so gorgeous. Like these, I need these in my life. But unfortunately, they're all pretty rare and very difficult to find, especially for not ridiculous prices. Um, number three, we got the Dogs for Life t-shirt. I can't remember what year this was. I think it was 2009, but this is one of those t-shirts where every single colorway 
goes off like just so fire they absolutely murdered this design i would sell my daughter for supreme to make more designs that look like this um not really that's actually a really messed up statement but i might i don't know dude like this is such a sick t-shirt i would do some crazy things for it not so crazy that you're thinking of i feel like y'all be thinking of some demented shit no i would do some wild shit though to cop one of these tees because i just love it um i'm not even much of a dog person you guys just saw my cat a second ago but i'll act like I am. I don't know, dude. The Rottweiler on this going crazy ham, homie barking and shit. This reminds me a ton of the Givenchy Rottweiler t-shirt, which is another classic, like a really sick design. So I really want to grab one of these at some point. I've been looking for this one for a while as well. I don't know what it is. I just can't find it for like a good price. Um, but help me out. Like, come on guys, please. I'm so desperate. But um, let's go to our top two items I need to buy in 2020. So this next one means a lot to me. This is an item that I saw way back in the day like so long ago probably one of the first supreme items i ever saw and that was because my man tyler the creator was rocking this a lot like a lot lot this is probably one of the most worn most notorious tyler the creator hats i'm talking about the supreme posse corduroy snapback <laughs> oh my god bro they don't make them like this no more um this is a crazy one some of you guys might recognize this because obey actually like ripped off this design savagely for their obey posse hats that are super cringy but this is 10 times cooler because it says supreme i don't yeah i know it's really bad reasoning but i don't know what it is this one just is so clean i mean first off i absolutely love corduroy so like that just makes it hit for me um the font though i think is gorgeous and just like the history behind this hat knowing that this was one of like the most notorious tyler the creator items he ever rocked and i remember seeing him in this one 24 7 for those that don't know tyler the creator used to be really well known for rocking green supreme hats i'm tyler mr green hat pro abortion anti-clean rats and this is probably one of his most worn um hats that i ever saw him in so yeah i just need to get this one i've been searching forever i found one dude that was saying like dm me offers and i asked this dude 200 dollars for this hat and he said nah mm. like <laughs> bro, 200 on this and he said no that just goes to show how much of a grail this is i know i'm gonna get one of these eventually i just don't know when i need to get it though at some point because i just it's an iconic hat for me this hat's just so nostalgic for me and like being one of the first supreme items for me to ever see or like interact with it's just a grail i need to get this one please somebody hook me up but let's move on to our number one item i need to buy in 2020 and a lot of you already know this design maybe drop some guesses of what you think i'm gonna say is my number one needed item in 2020 maybe one of you could predict it because it is like a really well-known item let's cut the crap and just get into it though we got the supreme patchwork these and niggas talking must not know who i am At how all. about that porsche the tripping bro? This thing is so fire, bro. I just know there will never be a Supreme jacket that is more original, more creative, more just like than this piece right here. Um, I've never actually gotten to see one of these or touch them in person, probably because I'd nut myself. Like they're probably trying to keep me away from this jacket because a homie would explode from excitement. Like this is such an iconic Supreme design. And that's really crazy because this is a really recent item. I think this dropped in like 2016, which makes me want to puke to think about because I actually remember when this released, people said it was super ugly. And I even think I was one of the people that called this ugly because I just like wasn't woke to this whole like supreme lifestyle i don't know the old me was a damn fool because this is probably like top five top ten most iconic supreme jackets of all time um there's just crazy prints all over this thing patched all together very ass pizza looking even though this was way before ass pizza i love it i love it so much i need it in my life these go for over a rack now which is ridiculous but of all supreme items to go for that much money i'm not even shocked um this thing is iconic in my opinion and i really wish i could either get the pants or the jacket I'd take either. I don't care. I'm not picky. Just give me something, man. This thing is just, ugh, I'm blown away by it. I need to wear this in an outfit pick like once. Somebody just let me borrow it or something, bro. I need this. This is probably one of my all time grails. I think I've even put this on other lists of like my grails or like wish lists. So yeah, I need to buy this eventually. I know it's going to have to be so much money when I do buy it. So like, God damn, bro. I'm not ready for the check. I'm going to have to drop on this. That's the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Feel free, like I 
I said to let me know your like grails or what you got to what was that? Your grails or what you got to cop for 2020. I hope you guys enjoyed this list and like I also said, let me know if you want to see more of these top 5 top 10 videos. Spend your boy Boone. I'll see you in the next one. I promise that every supreme item I bought in 2019 video is on the way. It's just going to take me a long time to edit, film, do all that good stuff. So yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Spend your boy Boone. I'm out. Peace. If I went down again, would you get tired?